Hi friends, so this video shows how to create a remote JIT branch. So let me run JIT branch. So in this project, you can see this has only one local branch master. So I am going to create a new uh, branch, new remote branch. So for that, we can uh, we have two options. Option one, you can run JIT branch. Then name of the name of the new branch. Let me give a uh, branch one. So this is the name of the new branch. So let me check it. Just to run JIT branch. It will show the lo all local branches. You can see the newly created local branch here. Then just go to that branch. You can run JIT uh, checkup branch one. Now, if you run JIT branch, you can see right now you are in that branch. You can see the star symbol here because that means that is a current branch. Now you can make some changes and then commit it. Like uh, make some changes in the code, then run uh, JIT commit hyphen a then commit it then you can push this local branch to remote for that you can just run git push origin branch one just run this command it will create a new remote branch with the name branch one is very simple so this is one option let me show you the second option you instead of creating a new branch with git branch command then switching to that branch you can do these two steps in one line you can just run this git checkout hyphen b branch 2 so this command first check if there are any branch with any remote branch with the name branch 2 if it is not there create new local branch then move to that branch let me run this command after that if you run cheat branch you can see it's automatically changed current branch to branch 2 now you can do the same thing make some changes in the code then run git commit hyphen a after that you can do the same thing uh, git push origin the name of the local branch which you which you want to push to the remote so this way we can easily create a new remote branch so you can also create a remote branch with the, some other name for example in this command when you run this command actually it create a remote branch with the name branch 2 suppose you want you don't want a new remote branch with the branch 2 you want to give a different name so that you can give like this just put a colon and then you can specify the name of the remote branch so in this way you can give new name for the remote branch this is the name of the remote branch and this is the name of the local branch in this way we can push local branch to remote with the new name okay i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel please like and share the video